Emergency Relief Coordinator. Um, I expressed my concern about what we have been uh, seeing. Uh, again, I was told that uh, this was uh, propaganda. Uh, my view as uh, the person who is responsible for humanitarian affairs for uh, the United Nations is that if uh, innocent civilians are being targeted or are being caught up uh, in the conflict by any of the parties to the conflict, they must be reminded of their responsibilities under humanitarian uh, law. Civilians should not be targeted, nor should humanitarian workers. And we need to make that point very forcefully to whoever is engaged in the conflict in Syria. My job is to try to find a, a solution and to do my best to get in, uh, to get humanitarian assistance to the people who need it. I am desperately worried about what has happened to the people, uh, for example, who used to live in homes. We don't know where they are. We don't know what their needs are. Some, of course, uh, will be sheltering with friends uh, or with family. Uh, some uh, may have crossed uh, the border. We don't know. But we need uh, more transparency, more openness. We need to know what is happening to people. I think it's entirely possible to get humanitarian assistance into Syria now if the Syrian authorities uh, agree to it. We don't know what the scale of the humanitarian situation might be and how it might develop over the next uh, few days. Uh, it is critical to have a better sense of what is going on. Of course, we know some uh, from uh, uh, the, the uh, organizations that are able uh, to have uh, some access, but even those organizations uh, are not able to get to all the places that they need to. We also need to know where the wounded are 